Julius J. Carey was a man with superb talent. During his time on TV, he was able to win fans over by pouring life into the character or any role he played. The actor's career-defining moment was when he bagged a villain role in the 80s blockbuster film, The Last Dragon. Carey acted as Shonuff, a man who opposed the good guys with his fighting skills and overwhelming confidence. Even after the box office movie, he was dubbed the villain character's name Shonuff, as lovers of the film could not get over his outstanding role. After many years of acting in other productions, Carey passed away in August 2008. Carey died in his Studio City residence in California, after suffering from pancreatic cancer complications. Before the tragedy struck, he had looked healthy, and many were not aware of any health challenges. The news of his death was a very bitter pill to swallow, and the industry mourned the death of an icon. Here are more details about his life works, a legacy that will live on in the hearts of many, despite the actor's exit from the world. He was born in Chicago, Illinois, in March 1952. The, the Last Dragon, alum lived most of his childhood years in the Lakewood Meadow neighborhood and studied in St. Elizabeth Catholic School. Acting became interesting during his teenage years when he played roles in classical plays like Hamlet and West Side Story at Hales Franciscan High School. After spending one year at Quincy College, he moved on to Loyola Marymount University, where he bagged a master's degree in communications. With determination and passion, the graduate began the journey to stardom in the 1970s. Shortly after his degree, he landed roles in 1979's Disco Godfather and The Fish That Saved Pittsburgh. Carey later starred in 1985's The Last Dragon, which gave him due recognition from the industry and fans nationwide. The actor's other famous works were The Adventure of Brisco County Jr. The New Guy, World Gone Wild, and The Man with the Red Shoe. He was also a prominent figure in Black Hollywood by starring in other family dramas and sitcoms. The episodic dramas that featured him were, Moesha, Cosby, Jag, It's a Living Duet, Boy Meets World, and The District. The on-screen martial art expert, Shonuf was survived by his second wife, Naomi. He was first married to a woman named Kathy Smith. Other family members include his brother, Ronald, and mom, Reverend Helen Carey, an executive minister who worked in Christ Universal Temple. The Last Dragon was a cutting-edge film at the time of its premiere in 1985. It made a whopping $25 million after it dropped. Fans were not the only ones in awe of Carey role in the film. The 6 feet 5 inches actor also developed a healthy relationship with his co-stars, who in turn spoke highly of him. Leroy Green, who played the hero in The Last Dragon, explained that his colleague was impressive behind the camera and effortlessly brought life to the seemingly over-the-top character. Carey was prepared to give his best in the film. Testimonies from other people that watched him backstage recorded that he was focused on getting the martial arts moves correctly and worked vigorously, despite sustaining wounds in his biceps. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe.